I am really sorry if anything were to pop out in the course of this video because apparently I've gained so much weight that I can't even fit into the freaking dress anymore. Ugh. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and today I'm going to be doing the accent quiz. And for those of you who are not too familiar with this quiz, basically it's a bunch of questions and I'm just going to go through and answer right off of my phone. I just like... I looked up accent quiz online and the first one that came up I just clicked on it It basically just asks you like a whole bunch of questions and you have to answer them and at the end of it they calculate it for you and tell you which accent you have so I think basically I have to go through and like pronounce different words for instance the word like caramel or caramel like which one would you say you know I personally believe that it's caramel caramel I think it's caramel, not not caramel. It's caramel, right? Okay, so now that you guys know how it works, let's just jump right into it. Okay, so before we go any further with these questions, I have to say that I am from the Caribbean and we were colonized by Britain. So now that I'm living in America, it's like I have two sets of pronunciations. Like I have pronunciations that I have adopted from growing up in the Caribbean, um, which is more British, and then I have obviously the American pronunciations. So it's like, I can go either way on these, but let's just see how it goes. What do you call a sweetened, carbonated beverage? They have pop, soda, or Coke. Coke is just like, it's one type of carbonated beverage. Who says pop? No one, no one says pop, like, no. I think it's soda. I'm just gonna hit soda. Even though I'm tied, like, I'm not really sure which one to go with. Like, I'm not sure if to go to soda or Pepsi, or soda or Coke, not Pepsi. Okay, so next one is, how would you address a group of two or more people? And the options are, y'all, you all, you guys, you, you, you nuns, yons, you, you ones? That doesn't make any sense. Unless I'm just like pronouncing it wrong. Yins? 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 What the fuck is that? Okay, I'm definitely, you guys, I say you guys all the time, like to even to you guys, like I say, all the fucking time so I think this one's a no-brainer this one is you guys next one what do you call a drive-thru liquor store drive-thru liquor store what the fuck is that shit like I've never heard of a drive-thru liquor store this is fucking California we don't have that shit here okay so the options are brew through a wet uh, I'm pretty sure that that's my answer beer barn we have these in my area but there's no specific term for them or party barn i'm gonna go with a what because i've never heard of a drive-thru liquor store in my entire life do you say the first a in pasta well how else did you say it pasta pasta no you don't skip over that fucking a that a is like really important what do you call a small gray bug that curls up into a ball when it's touched. Roly poly, pill bug, potato bug. I know what this is, but I have no word for it. Literally, I don't think it's any of these answers because where I grew up, it's actually called a kungari. Kungari definitely does, is not listed here. Even living in America for like the past, like, I don't know, 10 years, like I still have not heard any of these other names for this bug. So I'm gonna go with, I don't know. What would you call a sale of unwanted items on your porch or a yard. Before I even read the answers, I'm gonna put my answer as yard sale. Let's see. They have tag sale, never heard of that. Garage sale, okay, I've heard of that, but that's like in your garage, you know what I mean? Not like on a yard. Um, rummage sale, never really heard of that. And then they have yard sale, so I'm just gonna hit yard sale. Okay, so next up is, how do you pronounce the word crayon? So I'm pretty sure that's how I pronounce the word crayon. Let's see what options they have. One syllable rhymes with man, crayon, no. That's crayon, right? Who says that? Crayon, I don't know. With two syllables, where the second syllable rhymes with dawn, crayon, dawn. Okay, sounds like crown. You guys, I'm having the hardest time sitting here in this freaking dress because literally my sister gave this dress to me like years and years ago when I was obviously a lot skinnier and now I've gained a little bit of weight and it just, I'm having the hardest time sitting in it because it's literally just like opening up on me. Okay, so I'm gonna go with the third answer, which is two syllables. The second syllable rhymes with Dawn, Crayon, Dawn. What about Mary? Mary and Mary. There's M-A-R-Y, which is Mary. M-E-R-R-Y, which is Mary. And there's M-A-R-R-Y, which is Mary. Kinda of getting a little bit confused now that I've been saying it like 
a million fucking times. I think that they're all different. Whatever, fuck. I'm just gonna hit all different. What about collar and collar? Okay, obviously that's different. Collar is like what's on your shirt and collar is like when someone calls you or like you call someone like on the phone. Collar. Collar ID. Not collar ID. Collar. Collar and collar. Am I saying it the same thing, you guys? I mean, I don't know. In my head, it literally sounds like two different things. Collar. Like, collar and collar. Like, now I'm saying it the same. I feel like in the beginning, I was not saying it the same. Oh my god, now my eyes are like watering because I'm so stressed from these freaking words. <laughs> when you say on, does it rhyme with lawn or with John? Lawn, John, on. I feel like it's a lawn. Let's pick lawn. What vowel sound do you use in the beginning of the word horrible? Horrible. Oh, horrible. No, darling, it's horrible. 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 If you guys have not seen that movie, it's a superstar. You need to check it out. If you guys have not seen it, you are not living. Ali Shannon is like freaking hilarious. Do I see the words heel or hill? Heel? Hill. Who the hell says the word heel and hill the same? Like how can you say the heel of my shoe? No. No, no, no. It's the heel of your shoe, honey. Heel of your shoe. And the hill, you don't say I'm going up that heel. Like, you're going up the hill. Okay? That's definitely a no-brainer. No-brainer. I don't care what accent you have, that's a no-brainer, okay? Do you say words like ba, pass, and staff with the same vowel as bat, pack, and trap? I do. Guys, oh my god, I'm like busting out of this fucking dress. So uncomfortable. Never again am I gonna wear this dress or something this low cut. Oh my god, and now it's my eye. Jesus lord, I'm just going through it, you guys. <sighs> Ugh. Pen and pin. Do they sound the same to you? No. Definitely no. Pen is a completely different word from pin. I've never in my life even thought that they sounded the same. So no. How do you pronounce the first syllable of lawyer? The first syllable of lawyer rhymes with boy. Law, boy, you know, lawyer. The first syllable is like law, right? Boy. Oh, I get it. I get it, I get it. The first syllable includes the Y. I wouldn't think that. I would think it's L-A-W and then the second syllable is Y-E-R. But I guess that was wrong, girl. Lawyer, boyer. Yeah, I think, I think that. Choose your guilty fast food addiction. Oh my god, this is TM right now. How am I gonna pick one? Okay, there's In-N-Out, which is like the biggest deal in the world here in California, especially here in Los Angeles. There's White Castle, which I have, haven't actually seen in real life. I've seen the movies, but I've never seen one in real life. Pot Belly, never heard about that. Chick-fil-A, you know I would never go there, honey, never. And you know why. Because they're nasty, homophobic assholes, that's why. Crystal, okay, I've never heard of that before. Culver's, never heard of that before. Um, Chipotle, love Chipotle, love Chipotle. And then there's Rita's Italian Ice, like, I've never heard of that before, so I'm gonna hit In-N-Out because I am obsessed with In-N-Out, even though I don't really eat it as much as I would like to eat it, but... It's probably a good thing that I don't eat it as much as I would like to eat it in and out. Okay, you guys, whoa, that was the end of the quiz. That was like super, super quick. Let's see. Okay, wait, so this thing is telling me that I have a New England accent. I have yard sales and I know what a pill bug is. Like the thing is telling me that I know what a pill bug is, even though I put my answer as I don't know what the fuck a pill bug is. The little thing that curls up when you touch it. Clearly this thing is bullshit. Dropping R's and words like car, card, fear, etc. No, I do not drop my R's. This thing is bullshit. I do not drop my R's. New England? Where the hell is New England, you guys? Is that in America? You guys, I have no idea what a New England accent sounds like, but apparently it sounds like this. So now you guys know I sound like I'm from New England. So now that you guys know that, you guys can all go out with your day because I know you guys are all sitting there wondering, what kind of accent does she have? Now you know, girl. Now you know. Okay, you guys, so if you guys like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe, and I will see you guys soon. Bye!